So I'm not sure if you guys have like kids that do what mine do. I told my son to go clean his room and then this is what he comes out as. Um, bandana, he found his wrist stuff, found some glasses and then a bandana. I'm not sure what's going on. And then he was a juggler just a few minutes ago. He had his pants hiked up all high and then he was juggling. The way Dallas Pike was pitching. Totally. What word are you looking for? Inviting. Huh? Inviting. Inviting? Yes. Inviting. I don't see them. I don't see them inviting. Craig, what do you think I'm making? Crockpot? Crockpot with what in it? Chicken and potatoes. No. You made it before. Cause yeah, I know since you're putting that in it. Mm-hmm. I'm making chip chicken and dumpling. Yeah, that's what it's called. And um I'm trying to think. It was April's cook April's cooking video. She did like a easy crock pot recipe. So that's what I am doing. What are you doing? I am making. Let's start with you. Wait, is this so dough? Mm -hmm. oh. Making dough into a ball. Oh, for what? Um, to make something. What are you making? Um, I forgot what it was called. Chicken dumpling. Yeah, chicken dumpling. I was, I'm subscribed to this um, girl, her name is April's Cook Channel, and she does like five minute videos of quick recipes and stuff, and this one I've tried before and it was really good, so we're going to have chicken dumpling tonight, and it's really cool because you just stick those in there, let it let it steam up or whatever, and then they actually get bigger than that. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys, so this is what the chicken dumpling looks like so far. I stuck all of the um, dumplings, whatever it's called, I stuck them all in there, made them into little little tiny balls, and uh, in a few minutes you'll see how big the balls get, and then um, once it... Once I feel like it's cooked, then I'll stir it because if I stir it now, it'll just break the balls up So there's what it looks like So you see how much it lifted Here's where I can carefully mix it and stir it around So yummy I can't eat this tonight because um, It's past my meal time I'm Trying to you know, be good so yes, do it. Good morning, my people. I am in another cleaning mood, I guess. I am cleaning my granite countertop. It's important to use the granite sealer just because there's stuff that still can get into the little particles or in the little cracks of your countertop. So um, it's been a while since we've moved in here, which was a couple of years ago. And so yeah, I'm just cleaning, I'm just sealing it in again. I'm just going to tackle it just because I noticed like, I don't know if the camera will pick it up, but there's the yellow stain right here. Plus, you know, when you got kids, you got boys and stuff, they're messy, they play sports and stuff, and you just want to make sure everything is A-OK -okay and safe. So today I'm making egg rolls. Yummy! So, for the ingredients for egg rolls, for the layout that you'll need is ground pork, five packs of ground pork. You pretty much think one pack per egg roll shell. So I got five of these and then five of these. An onion, four carrots, you can use three or four. A whole cabbage. This is what the spring roll shell looks like. And this is the one that I get. I'm still experimenting with the right spring roll wrappers. 
So that is a work in progress because the ones in Washington, the Asian stores in Washington are different than the ones out here. So it is a little difficult to find the, the same ones. I'm also using some vegetable oil. That is the best vegetable oil for it. And I'm going to be blending everything in one of these things here. Hi, Coco. Sit. Good girl. Good girl. Yeah. Hi. Say hi. Say hi, people. <laughs> oh, say hi. Oh, say hi. <laughs> what your mix should look like so far minus the meat so I'm gonna go ahead and mix this in and then add the meat in after that the reason why I'm mixing this separately from the meat is because you don't want to over mix the pork just because it will get tough and you don't want tough meat so now that I've mixed it all it should look like this and I'm ready to go ahead and add in my meat. Now I'm gonna wash my hands because I am gonna be mixing it with my finger. I am gonna set a towel around in like a circular, circular deal just because this is gonna move around. Put the bowl on top. And I'm going to start mixing with my hands. So now what I'm going to do is I am just going to get a spoon. And I am going to, to do some practice samples to make sure that the stuffing tastes is good. So I'm going to make a couple of patties to try them out. Just cooking these patties to make sure that the stuffing is A-OK. -okay. And then after that, we're ready to roll. So I've got my layout here. I've got my glass pan <laughs> to put the egg rolls on after I'm done rolling them. Got my egg yolk in here. I've got the, the good good. This Crick. is the good good. And he's going to help me peel and we've got two spoons because he's going to roll and then I've got my yolk or my egg whites here and then my cutting board here my drink here my remote here because I am going to be here for a while and I'm watching Empire I had to watch this was like my third time because it's kind of confusing so how to roll them is pretty easy you just take um, a spoonful so first things first you're going to want to take the egg roll wrapper and you're going to want to take about a spoonful it's really, you're just guesstimating, and then you're going to put it on the sheet. Kind of like that. And then fold, tuck, tuck, roll, fold one side, fold the other side. Roll and then take your egg whites, place it on the end where you're going to fold, kind of like an envelope, and then you're just going to roll, and that's how you do it.
Look at this bear, guys. I'm like right by it. Oh my God, that's crazy. My mom would love this. Oh my gosh. We have to stay away, right? Is it gonna hurt me? Oh my gosh. That is crazy. He's just eating the grass. Oh my gosh. Should I go get in my car? Wow. <laughs> How was your ride home from school? Good. Did you beat Craig? Yes. But like where is one, he? But like one number. One number? Oh, where's Craig? I painted this. Oh, That's what I learned in what's that? <laughs> um, Is that a pumpkin? Huh? Yes, sir. Oh, Spider-Man? Uh -huh. I'm going to make it into a yes, sir. airplane. Oh, I thought this was a um, pumpkin. It's not a pumpkin. A, a doctor it's pumpkin? Like a... No. <laughs> Where you uh, do research on a topic and then you have to tell about the topic that you got. So I have to tell about, <coughs> I have to tell yes, about, sir. thank you. I have to tell about the government for all. Who did you see at school? Miles. No, you didn't. Uh-huh. No way. From the Broncos team, mascot. What did he do? It was all crazy and he kept running all over the place. Oh, really? Uh-huh. Where, was he in the gym? Yeah. Oh. Wow, that's cool, lucky kid. Oh! Sorry, Go -Go. What are you doing? I'm vlogging you. I'm vlogging you. Quit playing. You quit playing. Quit playing. You quit playing. Let me see the muscles. Honey. Don't have Flex. Why do you think I'm going to the gym? Because I don't have it. Honey, flex. I am flexing. 